Honestly, a bunch of people probably will die in the beginning. It's, yeah. it's tough sledding over there. It's Saturday Night Live! You know, forever, we don't want to make anyone go, so it's like <laughs> volunteers only. He's been called an eccentric billionaire. Well, Elon Musk is now going to dip his toe into the world of entertainment. And it's causing a bit of controversy, which is pretty much what Elon Musk likes. So here to break this all down for us is Sun Media's entertainment editor, knows all the things when it comes to the world of entertainment, Mark Daniel. So let's go and talk, uh, let's go back a little bit, Mark. Why, for starters, is Elon Musk even hosting SNL and how has the reception been? Uh, so, uh, you, you know, your guess is as good as mine. Elon Musk is not known for his humor. He's not known for his acting. Uh, he's not known for his, catch, his sketch comedy skills. There you go. You gotta be kidding me. Sorry? You're Elon Musk. I am? Uh, he is the CEO of Tesla. He's the world's third richest uh, man. He's worth about $179 billion. But yeah, it's a big question mark as to why he's gonna be hosting on May 8th with Miley Cyrus. A lot of people don't know. I myself, I'm kind of cautiously curious. I, I, I will be tuning in to see just how funny uh, Musk really is. Uh, you know, I will be tuning in as well, Mark, not just to see Elon Musk, but also to see Miley Cyrus, who actually just played at the halftime show for the NCAA March Madness. And I thought she she did a great job. She played all sorts of rock tunes, Joan Jett and Queen. She did a really interest, uh, really nice, uh, nice job on that. But back to Mr. Musk, who is no stranger to fighting. He's no stranger to, you know, taking anybody on. He most recently tweeted even at the other billionaire Jeff Bezos, um, that he, quote, can't get it up because Elon Musk's company, uh, SpaceX, just got awarded a contract from NASA. Bezos is taking them to court and there's a fight. But is Musk even responding to some of the backlash of him being the next host of Saturday Night Live? No, he's he's winding it up. He said, let's see how live Saturday Night Live really is. The SNL cast, some of them are not happy uh, that Elon Musk is going to be hosting on May 8th. Bowen Yang tweeted, what the f does that even mean? And then you had Andrew Dismukis, who's uh, one of the show's writers, who's now jo joined the show as a, as a regular cast member, said, the only CEO I want to do a sketch with is Sherry O'Terry. And then A.D. Bryant also took aim at Elon Musk, uh, mainly at his wealth, uh, saying that it's obscene that uh, one of the richest men on the planet is hosting the show. Uh, you know, he is, as I mentioned, uh, one of the third, the third richest person in the world. Well, I think it's a bit misguided, Mark, because this is all about eyeballs and you're competing for a lot of uh, space. Uh, where it's occupied already. And I think certainly by virtue of the fact that Elon Musk is drawing some of this controversy, I think they might actually see a nice bump in the ratings, regardless if you agree or disagree with uh, Elon Musk, he's certainly going to draw some attention. Yeah, for sure. I mean, just the other day, Adrian, he said that the first people, the first travelers to go to Mars uh, should be prepared to die. So it's volunteers only. I think there's something sort of scary and refreshing about someone who's so honest about their ambitions, you know, both on this planet and outside this planet as well. I think it's interesting to note, though, Donald Trump hosted the show in 2015. Show had great ratings. And, and even back then, some of the cast members, Taryn Killen, they, they were upset with the idea that Donald Trump was hosting. They don't have my talent, my money, or especially my good looks. So I think it, it's going to be quite fun, especially if Mr. Musk mm -hmm. uh, plays with that and, and makes some jokes about his unlikability. So Mark, even though this scheduled appearance is to be on May 8th, is it possible he could still get canceled? You know what, Adrian? I would say the chances of that are very, very, very slim. Uh, producers, Lauren Michaels, they would have known that there would have been some controversy with the selection of Elon Musk. So I think they're they're counting on it. They're counting on that curiosity factor like we both talked about, that we're going to be tuning in because we're curious to see how this all turns out. I think there's zero chance of that happening. All right. Thank you, Mark. So we will be watching 
Will you watch Elon Musk's appearance on Saturday Night Live? Log on to Facebook and Twitter. Let us know what you think. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.